We got Tia Fimo Lopez coming this week. Before I talk about Tia Fimo Lopez, right? It's a little duck out here. His name is Canelo Alvarez. And I really hate to say it if he really just ducked Benavidez like that because if he's ducking Benavidez, it's like to fight who? No, why you here though? Real quick though. Can you hit the like button? Real rap though. Like it's, 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 I'm not asking for much. Just hit the like button for me real quick though. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm I'm a good guy. I'm a nice guy. I'm not really mean. I don't really be like like bothering people and stuff like that. I just be wanting people to hit my like button. And you get what I'm saying? I'm going to be honest. I don't care if it's to fight Badu Jack and Badu Jack beat him or whatever. I don't want that fight. I don't care for that fight. This year has been too fucking precious for me. But I get it. If if he want to hold out, he a goat. Can I really call him a duck? I'm off of Canelo because like he don't deserve that much time right now. We're going to talk about Tiafimo Lopez. I'll tell you like this, man. You know why I say I killed this man? It's because I want to die low key. At least if I die, I die doing what I love. You want to die? Yeah, but only in my ring, you know. Can't die outside the ring. No. We need a five-second moment of silence for this nigga Tiafimo Lopez. Tiafimo Lopez, I'm really praying for you, bro. When you said you want to die, I seen that coming. I'm not going to lie. And I'm not saying I want to see that result. But I seen those words coming out of you because I've been watching your career for so long. Like, everything you've been on ain't really been making sense. And I'm not feeling that, John. We're not feeling that, John. So listen, Tiafimo, this is what I ask out of you, you fucking dickhead. Yeah, because you a dickhead now. I don't care what your John is. Use a dickhead, right? If your dad is going to be a coach, if this is the person that you're keeping as your head trainer, let your dad be a fucking coach, you fucking numbnut. You get what I'm saying? Like, why are you not letting him coach you? Who you think you is? You you might as well just have an ice man, you know what I'm saying, and somebody squirting water in your mouth, pause, and somebody that take out your mouthpiece. I'm not trying to hear Tiafimo Sr. said, oh, I felt my son, he's a counterpuncher and all that, and the fight didn't happen yet, but I'm not digging your joint, I'm not feeling your joint, I think you're all full of shit. From the rip. I'm not feeling y'all Jones. No, I'm not feeling y'all Jones. I'm thinking y'all Jones is like kind of corny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not feeling you niggas Jones. You niggas Jones is shitty. No, but seriously, T.O., like, you need help, bro. Let your dad be Let your dad be a coach. You know what I'm saying? Trust your dad. You be the fighter. Let your dad be a coach. I'm not buying the whole John that, oh, I, I fell my son and all that. I get what he's doing, and that's real leadership. I respect it, but... I don't respect it because y'all popped it. And I'm a nigga that's like been silently rooting for y'all. I made a little short talking about it, but like I'm rooting for you niggas, but y'all make it hard to root for y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all shit so weird and messy. Like I, we don't really, we don't know what's y'all join. Like y'all need to make us, help us understand what's y'all join. Like I'm not feeling you niggas joins. You niggas joins don't make sense to me from the rip. So yeah, T.O., the, the, the jig is up, bro. Like, you fighting a dog. You lucky you not fighting Matias or Regis with all this stress y'all got going on. And listen, I ain't like the little shit last time when ESPN had cut to you. I had tweeted about that. And I seen what they did with this video. Don't let them get in between you and your dad, you weak dickhead. You get what I'm saying? You already talking about chalking yourself. And I'm not trying to be funny, but I already seen how they edited it. They made it seem like your dad came in the room and then that... He just jumped in at the perfect time of asking that question. They put the little John T.O. Sr. walks into the room. I peeped the whole time that they jumped a few questions over. And then you overreacting and shit. Like, no, nah, that's your dad. You get what I'm saying? At that point in time, he don't got to be your trainer or your manager. You sound crazy. You talking about, I want to die. Like, what the fuck? Like, oh, but it got to be in the ring. Like, no, nah, dickhead, you sound suit. You sound like you want to unalive yourself. You fucking dickhead. You get what I'm saying? That's not sturdy. Niggas not feeling that, John, cuz. Like, low-key, you probably shouldn't even be fighting today or tomorrow. You shouldn't be fighting tomorrow. Keep it a beam. But it is what it is. You mean? Your, your, your John is nutty. Your John is nutty. You mean? And 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 we not feeling your John, cuz. Yeah, we not feeling your John. But, yeah, like, you on some, oh, I, I want to say it how I want to say it type shit. I want to... Then you had the little John. I peeped your little John. Like, they wasn't trying to let you face off. You telling your dad, oh, I wish you would just be out there. Like, yo, you not in competition with your dad. Your dad not in competition with you. He got a big personality. 
little ass nigga. Like you got you a little nigga. Like I'm a little nigga, but I ain't a little nigga like you a little nigga. You a little nigga with some little nigga like I got everybody got to talk about me, little nigga. Like you know what I mean you're doing not healthy. You young dickheads in this next generation, you niggas is sensitive. Like you get what I'm saying? Like, and and I would have took you niggas nipples and twisted it because I'm not feeling you niggas Jones. You niggas is hoes. You know what I'm saying? And don't talk about no black fighters like that if you ain't gonna stand on that. You know what I'm saying? You know I mean, I be in Brooklyn every week. Niggas will strip you, cuz. It's a real rap. Yeah, it's like, no, I ain't gonna do that to you. I already know y'all turkey, though. You know what I mean? But, man, I want what's best for T.O., though, at the end of the day. He's a young man. I know he's confused, seeing a lot of crazy shit. I want what's best for T.O. The way I see the fight going is like what I said on the short. Whoever's backing up is going to lose. I think Tia the more the more talented fighter, though. Don't get me wrong. I think he's talented, super dynamic puncher. He could do a lot, but he don't really listen to his coach. He don't stick to his game plan. And lately, his jab just been reaching. He not peeling. I'm, I don't know what he trying to do. He ain't setting no traps. Like, I'm not really convinced. You get what I'm saying? Like, he want to slow it down and pick his shots. We already know what Josh Taylor going to do. He's coming to get you. You know what I'm saying? There's not really much else he could do. He could box a little bit, but he's going to get bored. He's going to try to fight. He's going to make you fight him. You know what I'm saying? I think the check hook's going to be there for both people all night. But then it's going to be a dog fight. They're going to be fighting in the middle. And who got the better inside fighting? I think T.O.'s a very dynamic puncher, but I haven't seen him, like, really create too much power on the inside. I've seen him, like have to close the distance quicker than motherfuckers and really use his athleticism. Which is, I don't think Taylor is all this crazy as, as like, his, he got a crazy resume. I don't take nothing away from Taylor, but, like, if if if, it, if I was talking about Tank or Shakur and all that and, like, Richardson Hitch, I'd be like, they'll wipe him out. But T.O. ain't been showing me that discipline or that poise more than anything. So, I'm going to say, uh... I'm going with Taylor, unfortunately. But I'm going to be rooting for T.O. But, like, realistically, I'm going to go with Taylor. I don't want to say stoppage, but they might throw in the towel. The, the ref might stop it. T.O. might just be looking confused. Like, I quit. No mas. It, I'm, you know what? It's going to be a no mas tomorrow. T.O. going to be like, you know what? Why am I here? Like, I'm about to go, like, try to go get my wife back. Like, you Matt Barnes type boy. Like, your joint is not sturdy. Your joint is corny, guys. I'm not feeling your joint. It's like, no. But, yeah, get the, get it together, though, T.O. You feel me? Even if you lose, niggas still want what's best for you. Niggas don't want to hear you saying, oh, I think I'm going to die. I want to die. Like, that shit is weak. You a bitch. You use a bitch. You a pussy, nigga. And, yeah, yeah, man up. Stop throwing your dad under the bus, you fucking dickhead. We not feeling that over here. T.O. Senior been there for you, cuz. I mean, don't let them trick you. You a dog. Show it, bitch. No, but seriously, T.O., you don't got to have all the answers. You don't got to have all the answers. You just got to show up and fight. And listen, this fight and shit, I don't care if I'm not a fighter. This shit is not more important than your child. This shit is not more important than your mental health. This shit is not more important than your spirit, nigga. This shit ain't more important than none of that. Get your shit together. You still that nigga, but you acting like a hoe. Yeah, we not feeling your joint. I'm not feeling your joint. I don't care what nobody's saying. I'm I'm telling you, I'm not feeling your joint. I don't care who's piping you up, who's lying to you, who's reinforcing this joint on you. I don't care if you win tomorrow. I really hope you win tomorrow. But, like, you acting like a whore. You know what I mean? Like, we got to call it spade a spade, cuz. Get your shit together. Like, get your shit together. Heal. You know what I'm saying? I can say more, but I don't want to, like, come at your ego too much. Because you need your ego in that ring and all that, but you sound like a bitch, man. You sound like a little nigga with a lot of little nigga syndrome. Like, you sound like a little nigga about to fight a heavyweight. Like, you're not about to fight no heavyweight, nigga. You that nigga, T.O., you that nigga. You that nigga. Get back to the basics. You that nigga, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? You a back flipping, left hook leaping ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you that bull. But you mean, your joint been like, we not. I'm not understanding your joint. Saying so, I don't think you're gonna win. I'm not gonna sit here and lie to you. I'm rooting for you more like on your mental health spirit, John. Like, I'm more so rooting for you to get good and come to peace with T.O. You know what I'm saying? All that other shit, don't nobody care about that shit, cuz I know I don't. I don't, I don't know the fuck you want. You know I mean like that shit is corny, bro? Like, niggas really fuck with you no matter what, no matter what, man. Real men out here see what's going on, and they like, damn, like, what's up with my man T.O.? Like, he losing it, nigga. You need a hug? You need a hug? 
You know what I'm saying? No, man, get your shit together, man. Take your time. It's, it's on your time. You know what I'm saying? Next fight, do it on your time. Do everything on your time, man. You earned it. You earned it, bro. You earned it. You know what I'm saying? But right now, you losing us. You losing us. We don't get it. And I'm not going to lie to you. We don't We don't know what you want. We don't get your drone. Your drone is highly confusing, guys. Yeah, your drone is highly confusing. You know what I'm saying? But, man, God bless you guys. Real rap. Um, on the other news, we got Earl Spence and Terrence Crawford. I I'm gonna make a separate video for them, but it's it's, it's the, the plot is getting thick. The plot is getting thick, cause like I'm going I'm gonna make my prediction video for them because it's like I got EJ beating them the fuck up. Yeah, this is gonna be the biggest fight of the decade. I got EJ beating Terrence Crawford the fuck up. It's gonna be fucking easy work. 